You can now make YouTube thumbnails, professional thumbnails with your own photos, with one prompt and one click on ChatGPT 4.0 image generation. Let's dive right in and get to it, okay? As you can see here, we're in ChatGPT. I'm gonna go and make this video like extremely freaking short so that you guys can see exactly how this works and you can just not waste any time by watching this. Of course, I want you to watch it. We're gonna go to a previous conversation that I already had. Literally, like I told you, one prompt. You can see here, we're in ChatGPT. This is the 4.0. You can see here, you can select your models, okay? And what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to this chat I was already having, okay? So let me zoom in and I'm gonna show you exactly what I did. Super, super simple. Let's go ahead and refresh this because I don't know why my images are not showing. Right, so cool thing is you can upload your own images. Really, really cool, trust me. Like vidIQ and stuff like that where they make your thumbnails, they're done. I mean, they probably spent millions of dollars on a software that just got blown away by ChatGPT 4.0 image gen. So what we're gonna do here I'm gonna show you exactly what I'm doing and what I said. This is the very start of my conversation and this is how well this works, okay? So I said, create me a professional, and mind you, you don't even have to say all this. I gave it three photos to reference. So all I did, I came down here. This is where you input the prompt. If you're not sure, if you've never used ChatGPT and you have no idea where I'm at right now, this is where you input the prompt and just talk to ChatGPT. Super simple stuff, I'm not gonna get into that, but here we go. What I said was create me a professional and engaging YouTube thumbnail that sticks out and is engaging. Make it say something like create insane YouTube thumbnails with ChatGPT 4.0. I have also uploaded my image, that's what I told it, and obviously it knows that. And then I said crop myself in the image and place it within the thumbnail. Do this as if you were paid $10,000 to make this thumbnail for me. Obviously, I don't know who in the hell is paying that much money to get a thumbnail. and. Maybe ChatGPT probably thinks that's pennies on the dollar, you know, but then I said, here are some images of me so you know what I look like. And within the first run, within the very first run, this is what we got. And this is what I'm gonna use for this video and you guys can see it. That guy looks pretty close to what I look like. I wouldn't say exactly what I look like. There is some other ones that I did that look a lot more like me. On my previous YouTube video, I use that thumbnail directly from a image generation from ChatGPT. So it did a pretty good job. It said create insane YouTube thumbnails with ChatGPT 4.0 and put a little logo of ChatGPT. And then it's got my image of me just kind of doing this, which is pretty freaking cool because as you can tell in this image above, I actually have my thumbs up. I'm not, I'm not even pointing. And ChatGPT thought it'd be more engaging if I was pointing. So like I said, I'm gonna keep this super short. To use this thumbnail, you simply just click download and you are all good to go. I'm sure I could show you millions and millions of examples of this, but just to keep it very, very short, this is what I, all I'm gonna show you today. And you can also, another thing I'm gonna show on the next video is you can upload your own logos and have it create like ad creatives and everything based on your logos, which is really cool. So I'll talk to everyone later. Have a good one. 